Welcome to Electron Line. So now let's try this example. Six molecules in the same size box, but now the box is divided into six equal parts. And what we're trying to do here is we're trying to find the number of microstates for each microstate and each configuration and the enthalpy for each. And as well, what is the total number of microstates you can have in a situation like this? So let's put up a few examples. Let's try this one. Let's put a molecule in each of the partitions in the box and then maybe we'll have a situation like this where we go 2, 0, 2, 0, 2, 0. So in these two configurations, these two particular macrostates, what is the number of microstates? Well, in this case, we can say that uh, W, um, let's call it W sub 1, we'll call this the first macrostate, and that's going to be equal to, we have six molecules, and now we divide that by one factorial times 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 one factorial. Well, you know that one factorial equals one, so the denominator is one, the numerator is 720, so the total number of 720 microstates in a situation like this. There's 720 different ways in which the molecules can be rearranged when the molecules are distinguishable and there's six of them. How about this case right here? Well, let's call that microstate number two and that would then equal six factorial for the total number of molecules divided by two factorial, zero factorial, two factorial, zero factorial, two factorial, zero factorial. Notice that zero factorial is equal to one 2 factorial is equal to 2, 1 times 2, so that's 2 times 2 times 2, which is 8, so that would be 720 divided by 8. Hmm, that means that this is equal to 90, 90 microstates, because 8 times 9 is 72, so that's 720. All right, so we have 720 different microstates here and 90 different microstates in this particular arrangement. Of course, there's many different ways when we have this arrangement here where we could put 0 and 2, but we're not getting into that yet. Now, what would be the total number of microstates in this arrangement? Well, it turns out that the number of microstates total is equal to, we have six molecules and six partitions. Actually, number of partitions and molecules, that's the way it goes. So the, the base is the number of partitions and the numerator I mean, the exponent is the total number of molecules. So what is 6 to the 6th power? Well, for that, I'm going to use my calculator. So 6 raised to the 6th power, that's a big number. There's a total of 46,600, is it 6? Is that a 6? 656, 656. As you can tell, my eyes aren't as good anymore as they used to be. Ah, there we go. So total number of microstates in all the various combinations, when we have six molecules in a box with six partitions, it's 46,656 microstates. All right, in this particular case, what would be the enthalpy? All right, the way to calculate the enthalpy, S, call it S of one, that's equal to K, which is the Boltzmann constant, times the natural log of omega sub one. I keep calling omega W sub one, W, not omega. All right, so this would be equal to 1.38, times 10 to the minus 23 joules per Kelvin. Should be minus, there we go. And multiply that times the natural log of, the natural log of 720. Okay, so take 720, take the natural log of that, oop, 720, take the natural log, which is about 6.6, .6, and multiply it times 1.38 e to the 23 minus, and we get, that's equal to 9.079, 9.079 times 10 to the minus 23 joules per Kelvin. And let's do it for this one right here. So S sub two is equal to K times the natural log of omega sub two. Ah, I keep calling omega, why? W sub two, all right. Um, so that's equal to 1.38 times 10 to the minus 23 joules per Kelvin. And multiply that times the natural log of W2, which is 90. So take 90 natural log, which is about 4.5, and multiply times 1.38 e to the 23 minus, and that gives us uh, 
210 times 10 to the minus 23 joules per Kelvin. So you can see that the randomness goes up depending upon which situation we want to consider. Same box, same number of molecules, but how we want to partition the box makes a big difference. First of all, in the number of microstates you can have, the possibility of the number of microstates and the associated randomness or entropy with each of those cases and that's how they're calculated and that is how it's done.